What's going on, Elite Fam? This is Ty with Green Regimen. Just want to give you a quick seven day update because think about this. What was once a random idea that I had in the car, just coming back from the gym, has turned into a full 31 day challenge. Pretty incredible, I have to tell you, because one, I never expected so many people to be so excited and to start sending pictures and to let me know their results and how things have been going. Never expected that at all, so I'm so happy. Please keep sending pictures, because what you're doing is with these pictures, when we repost your pictures, you're giving other people ideas. Let me give you an example. For example, yesterday, I received a message from a follower and she was saying how happy she was because she tried a plant-based challenge in the past, but she didn't have the proper support. So what ended up happening is she didn't really do things correctly and she got off track. So I was happy to hear that, that she's, you know, got back on track and she, you know, wanted to follow Green Regimen's challenge. And she sent me a picture of different types of foods that she's been eating. She sent me one picture of some eggs and I thought, wow, these eggs look just like real eggs. So I asked her, I said, how did you make those? And she told me how she made them. She made them out of tofu. So what I did is went to my refrigerator, had tofu in there and I made them as well. I actually went to a YouTube video and there's a bunch of YouTube videos. I should know I've been on YouTube since like 2014, but you know, yeah, you could jump on YouTube and learn everything. Well, anyway, I looked up scramble tofu and learned how to make them. Unbelievable. Like this is something that I normally would never decide to do because I'm really focused and, and set in my ways and I have the set meals that I used to eat. But this challenge has brought something out of me that I actually didn't think existed. Creativity, you know? So I also want you to keep in mind that this is only the first seven days. We do have another three weeks to go, but the way I'm feeling right now, oh wow, it's, it's pretty incredible. I'm I have a clean diet as it is, so I didn't necessarily expect to feel anything out of the ordinary just by dropping the turkey that I eat because I don't really eat beef at all. So I wasn't sure um, if my energy level would drop because of the turkey. I wasn't sure if my results at the gym, you know, in terms of my strength, my endurance, if that would be somewhat compromised. And I told you from the very beginning, I would be 100% honest with you, seven days in, I feel awesome. No question about it. And people around me who are also doing the challenge, I'm watching them. I'm listening to what they're saying, observing everything that they're doing. They're feeling good as well. So keep that in mind. It's only seven days. Now, as we progress between week two, three, and four, what I want you to remember is a lot of you are dropping beef from your diets. You're dropping turkey and all those other meats. So I want to make sure that you're looking at our Instagram highlights and you're looking at the other options that there are out there because when you just take meat off your plate and take it out of your diet, there are nutrients in meat that you're missing. So some of you out there might need to supplement with a multivitamin. I used to supplement with a multivitamin and I stopped that because I got some, got some tests done. For example, I got a vitamin test and I found that I really wasn't deficient in anything except like vitamin D. So I could start supplementing in vitamin D. But you know what I'm going to do now? Probably next week or so, I'm going to pick up a vitamin B12 supplement because even if you are a meat eater, you should still supplement with uh, vitamin B12. As a matter of fact, the cows that we get our beef from th and their food, they're being supplemented with B12 as well. So B12 is definitely a vitamin that I will start supplementing with just to see if I feel any difference. But listen, I feel awesome. So I did just want to give you an update on that. Thus far, I'm hearing nothing but positive results from people. So I absolutely love that you know, you're just pretty much encouraging me and motivating me to continue to do this. So let's keep it going. Also want you to know that other sponsors have been watching our contest and our prize package is just growing. So I told you at the beginning, we're going to have three separate winners and to be a winner, you just have to engage, send us your meals, tell us how you're feeling. That's the whole point. Show us videos. That's what it's all about. Not about losing weight, not about deciding that you're going to become vegan for the rest of your life. Not at all. I just wanted you to see from the very beginning how if you subtract certain foods from your diet, how it will have a positive effect on your health, even your state of mind. It's pretty awesome. I mean, in seven days, my state of mind is, has definitely elevated from the fact that I could step outside. Like, for example, last night, I decided to make something called overnight oats. Now, I've heard of overnight oats, but because I decided a long time ago I'm not going to eat oatmeal, I decided not to even look at any overnight oat, uh, oat recipes except last night. 
So I, I watched this uh, watched this video on how to make them, and I decided to throw some elite protein in my overnight oats. I had them this morning, right after my workout. Unbelievable. And it's like, what have I been missing? And what I want you to take from that is a lot of times we're just so stuck in our ways that we're, you know, we're just afraid to evolve a little bit and to become flexible. And with this whole challenge, that's what this is about. And part of it is a mental thing as well. So just wanted to tell you that. Outside of... Uh, how I'm feeling thus far, I'm hearing a lot of positive results. So let's keep it going. There's other vegans out there who haven't been vegan for a long time, but they're cleaning up their diets with this challenge. So I love hearing from you as well. Just more ideas, more options for people. That's what this is all about. Keep in mind, Elite Protein is definitely going to help you get through this challenge. Our CBD protein is going to help you get through this challenge. If you do work out and you're feeling soreness, it definitely helps reduce inflammation I'll give you a promo code because you're a part of the challenge. Keep that in mind. All right, there it is. I'll keep giving you different updates and everything. Of course, I'm going to give you a two-week update as well, three-week update, and then a wrap-up. But let's keep it going, all right?